this is so delicious galette the blain noir so it's um sarrasin or um blain noir c'est sarrasin or a buckwheat buckwheat is so delicious and uh, <clears throat> i think people uh, you can find it in um in supermarket in in whole food or some place because uh, it becomes trendy now because it's a, a gluten free it does not erase so it's very hard it's uh, the, because there is no gluten so it's not fermented or raised and um and so so people who is who likes eat gluten free is quite uh, um quite a la mode but because it's 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 delicious i eat it because it's delicious not for the reason of uh, gluten free very delicious let's see this is bleu noir we can take a look here So this is Blay Noir. You can see some black dots there. Right? The black dots. And um, this one is not Blay Noir, I think. I didn't mention Blay Noir. The Gulf. So biscuit de Bretagne. Oh, still there is no um, no um. I have this one. I have this one. This one. This one. I don't have this one. I need to have a picture. This one should not be Blay Noir. It's a normal wheat. We will take a look. Yeah, it's a... See the difference? Hmm. There's not this black dot. And Blay Noir is much darker. Mm. Much more delicious. I'm sorry to be so messy.
So good, this uh, plain one. In Japanese, it's a soba. In Chinese, it's chiao mai. Chiao mai mian jiao, the chiao mai mian tiao, or soba. The Japanese noodle soba, the black one. It's uh, more tense, more al dente, more strength. Wow, Bistro Edgewood, so beautiful. Panya, Sacramento. Oh, San Kuang Manto. The Mix Master. American Standard. Gosh, he looks so good in front of the toilet. <laughs> mm. It's so funny. Well, anyway, somebody will do this advertisement if it is not him. Wow. That looks good. Cool. 
Salida, Colorado. Looks like a fun place. Cochrane. Chihuly Tacoma Museum of Club. This family is too beautiful. <laughs> It's just too beautiful. It's unreal. <laughs> it's, it's too beautiful and you do not even feel warm. <laughs> Don't you agree there are times that uh, family... <clears throat> I was thinking about one thing. The, the, maybe that's the East, East Asian or East Oriental sort that's searching for imperfection. I remember when I was young and uh, my relative, my auntie, their family taking a whole family picture, take a full family picture, Quan Jia Fu, with everyone present. And they kick out one kid, <laughs> not kick out, because they say that full family, full house picture should have one person missing, that imperfection. I could not understand it at that time. Nobody understood, and we were all saying, oh, oh, Xiaomans was not uh, in and um, <clears throat> kicked out. It's their pursuit. I think there is something so profound about this searching for imperfection. Something is perfect. It loses. It lacks. The, it lacks something when it is perfect. It's missing something. Perfection is uh, is uh, is an incomplete thing. It is not right. Let's see this picture. It's just too perfect. Beautiful house, beautiful wife, beautiful kids, handsome husband, and everything just so beautiful. There is, there me something that is the warmth. That uh, empathy, that forgiveness, that something is not perfect, but part of this, uh, it's just too beautiful. It's uh, you can, or maybe because it's, just, I cannot relate to, so I cannot, uh, I cannot feel the feeling. Maybe there are other people they are beautiful, so they can feel that feeling. But I, for me, I just cannot feel profoundly, deeply touched by this two perfect beautiful thing. You feel something is missing. That's the problem of these kind of magazines. They make life too good and uh, it distance people. Maybe I should do a hot pot now. Mm -hmm. 